Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can share and comment on Word documents online. Let's go ahead and take a look at how this works. So I created my Word document online from my OneDrive online. And you'll see here's my sample document that I've written is just for demonstration purposes. Let's make my font a little bit larger so everyone can see it on the screen a bit better. Let's go a little bit larger than that. Let's make a 24 point font. There we go. Now, in the upper right corner, let's hit that share button. And we can share it in a few different ways. We can say anyone with a link can edit. And if we do that, we can even set an expiration date. And so maybe we'll say that uh, tomorrow is the expiration. And you can see we can set a password to allow editing as well. So let's set our password. Yes, I have a weak password, but let's use that one anyway. Now I'm going to copy that link. And I can give that link to anybody who I want to be able to comment on this document. So let's hit that copy button. Let's bring it up in a new window and see how someone would access this. So they'd see here, they'd have to enter in the password that was assigned to that document and submit it. And that's going to open up that sample document. And right now they're just reading it. But if they click on the edit option, then they'll have tools for editing, but they'll also have tools up here for reviewing. And they can add comments. So they can do that and then add the comment and say, this is a good opening to the document. And you'll see that that person is not signed in. So it's just a guest comment. Now, back here on my original copy, we'll see that I have that comment and I can say, thanks. And when I'm done with the comments as the owner of this document, I can go to more thread actions and I can delete the thread or resolve the thread. Let's delete it all together. And now it's gone. Now, there are other ways to share the document besides that. Go to the share button again. Let's review it. Let's go back here to anyone with the link can edit. I'm going to say not allow editing this time. And then only people who have the link can view the document. So now they can only view it. They won't be able to edit or comment on that document. And I also have the option here to enter in the email address of anyone that I want to share this document with. So I want to add in Mason, and I'm going to share it with Mason. So now I'll share it with Mason, and I'll give him a little message and say, please take a look at this doc, and let me know what you think about it. And I'll send that off to Mason. So those are a few ways that you can share your Word documents online and allow other people to comment or edit them as well. As always, for more tips and tricks like this, please check out practicaledtech.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.